Living things cannot move by themselves unless something makes them move. Watch this video. A force is needed to make it move. Forces are around us in our everyday life. Force helps us to do a lot of things in our daily life. Whenever we push or pull an object, we are applying a force on it. Other examples that involve pushing are knead a dough, squeeze a sponge, and push a trolley. Other examples that involve pulling are pull out a nail, draw back a bow, pull a fishing rod. Pushing and pulling are forces. Other examples of pushing forces Pressing a switch, kicking a ball, closing a drawer, squeezing out toothpaste. Can you name other activities involved in a pushing action in our daily life? Discuss and share with your class. Other examples of pulling forces Lifting a bag Opening a drawer Stretching a rubber band Pulling a Venetian blind Can you name other activities involving a pulling action in our daily life? Discuss and share with your class A force cannot be seen, but we can observe what it can do. For example, we can see the tree bend to one side when a strong wind blows on it. But we cannot see the force that is in the wind. Watch these two videos. Which of the following shows a pushing activity? Click on the video to choose the correct answer. Object away. A pull is an action of bringing an object towards us. Examples. Each boy can feel a push when their palms press against each other. Each boy can feel a pull when they pull at their wrists. In this case, push and pull are forces that cannot be seen, but their effects can be observed. However, the hand can feel the pull and the push that is applied. Can you name other activities that involve forces? How are the effects of forces observed, even though we cannot see force? Discuss and share with your class. Pushing and pulling are forces. Examples of activities that involve push actions. Need a door. Push a trolley. Examples of activities that involve pull actions. Pull a nail. Draw back a bow.